we keep moving stuff around because we keep growing. Let's open it up and look. I'll show you how we have them packaged. Very likely the gear he needs, and it being a 50 tooth gear, it's gonna have smaller teeth. But if you look at the difference between this gear and this gear, it's pretty obvious the teeth are very different. So all the teeth in this gearbox are gonna be different. You wanna heat this gear up to about 350 degrees, slip it right on the shaft. The reason you do that is if you crash your machine really bad, the gear will actually slip on the motor shaft. And I've seen that happen by putting marks on it. So if this gear has a broken tooth, obviously replace it. But if the teeth are just damaged and noisy, you probably need to replace the gear that matches with it. Whole gearbox was shifting back and forth and what was happening then is the orientation was shifting. After we did the spindle, we then did all the gearbox isolators. And now six months later, the gearbox is toast. 